side goes up on the wall, but the important side is this side. We always have the students sign the plaque to autograph their work, so when they find their plaque on the wall, they know their signature is on the other side. So we're really, really proud of our students' efforts. Because I'm gonna forget as the concert progresses, um, I actually have my mom in the audience over here sitting over on this side. She's coming out to hear the concert this evening. They're newly moved from Florida. Let's get my mom around in the park. We are going to close our portion of the concert with a piece composed by someone who is important to Fairfield County and important to the Pickerington local schools. Um, he taught school uh, at Liberty Union High School for a brief time. He was the chief arranger for the United States Air Force Band in Washington, D.C., but more importantly to us in Pickerington, he was the arranger, especially when it was one Pickerington High School way before there were two. Um, he arranged the shows for decades for the Pickerington marching band, and that's Mr. Bob Thurston. Um, he actually came to do a clinic with the students um, uh, a few weeks ago, and it was really awesome to have him in and talking to the students about uh, the process of composing the piece, and I grabbed this melody from here, and I wrote this part because of this life situation, um, and I thought the best advice he gave us is, as you get ideas, hang on to those ideas and put them away in a safe place, whether it's a journal or if it's music, you record it or scribble it down because he mentioned several parts of this piece of music that came from 40 years ago. You know, some things from middle school and some different things that happened. Um, so we hope you enjoy this piece, which was actually dedicated to Mr. Thurston's middle school band director in Tallahassee, Florida. And it kind of sets the picture. It's kind of a tone poem of the Native Americans of that region. And we're gonna perform for you Red Hill Saga.